Hey guys, welcome back. Anyway, today we're going to be learning about dental hygiene. So, hope you guys keep your teeth clean. Okay, anyway, we're going to be learning how to keep your teeth healthy. Because we've been focusing a lot about health and nutrition. Anyway, this is how to keep them healthy and strong. So you should brush your teeth for at least two minutes. Alright, do this in the morning and do it at night before you go to sleep. This is the most important thing of maintaining good oral hygiene is to adopt the crushing, the correct brushing technique. Ask your dentist or hygienist to teach you how to correctly use the toothbrush how to apply it to your gums and teeth. Wait about 30 minutes after eating before brushing your teeth after you eat. The acid produced by the food in your mouth causes the enamel to soften. Immediately after brushing, after eating, you should rinse your mouth with water. Then after 30 minutes, you can brush. Children should brush their baby teeth to prevent cavities and longer old hygiene habits. Protect your, so protect your teeth against decay by a toothbrush with fluoride. So if you use a large strength toothpaste for a young child, make sure it's at least 1,000 ppm of fluoride. All right, next one. Prevent tooth decay from occurring between your teeth by flossing. So flossing will remove food particles, plaque, and bacteria that might be hiding between your teeth where the bristles of your teeth of the brush can't reach them. Use about foot and a half of floss. Wind, wind it around one finger of your hand and... Use some mouthwash. You can reduce the amount of bacteria floating around your mouth by rinsing with an antibacterial mouthwash or a salt solution. If you either use a mouthwash, look for one with fluoride in it. So you guys can get these at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. Scrape bacteria off with a tongue with a scraper or by brushing it. The roughness of your tongue traps food particles of bacteria, which can contribute to do tooth decay. Don't press it if it hurts or bleeds. You should be gentle to see a firm of saliva and debris on the scraper. Don't smoke. Smoking will strain your teeth yellow, give you bad breath, and make you more likely to get gum disease and mouth cancer. If you already smoke, you can greatly increase your overall health and the health of your teeth by quitting. So reduce your sugar intake if you want to have a healthy diet for healthy teeth. When the bacteria in your mouth breaks down sugars, it reduces it produces acids which devolve in the protective enamel coating on your teeth. This makes your teeth more vulnerable to decay. You can limit your sugar intake by not eating desserts like candy. No adding sugar to your tea or coffee, eating low sugar breakfast cereals, avoiding sugary drinks and soft drinks, drink only one glass of fruit juice per day, even on sweet fruit juice is sugary. Avoid drinks that stain your teeth. The following can is the cause of one healthy, unhealthy looking teeth. Wine, tea, coffee. Cut down your alcohol consumption. Alcohol wears away. La, la, la. Eat extra crunchy raw fruits and veggies. These foods can help scrape your teeth, teeth clean as you eat them, and they are good for you. Other options include, let's see, apples, celery, carrots, peppers, cucumbers, lettuce, and broccoli. Reduce the amounts of sticky foods, uh, same thing. Limit amount of drinks if you're concerned. Here's the list. La, la, la. And drink a lot of extra water. And don't forget to visit your dentist if you have, all, if you have one of these. Red swollen or painful gums, bleeding when you brush and floss, gums are contracting away from your teeth, permanent teeth that are loose, pain, swelling your jaw, headaches, and that's all. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to end it here. If you guys want more of these, subscribe to my channel. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.